everyone. Okay, so by now you've probably already heard that there is a million dollar fish swimming around somewhere out here in Lake Martin and about 200 other fish that are valued at $1,500 each. And all you have to do is catch one of these tagged fish. Now, before you go reaching for your fishing poles, there's a couple of things that you have to do first. One, you have to have your Alabama fishing license and two, you have to be registered for Crank for Bank. Now me, I'm not a fisherman. I don't have either one of these things. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna walk you through step by step as I sign up so that way you can too and we can both get out there and try to win one of these big money fish. All right, look y'all, it is literally so easy that we're gonna do it right here from the dock. And also this way I can keep my eye out in case one of those fish jump up. Okay, so first things first, we are going to get our fishing license. This is very important, mainly because the state of Alabama requires everyone between the ages of 16 to 64 to have a fishing license to fish, um, with a few exceptions. Most Okay, let's just pause one sec just to clarify again. If you are between the ages of 16 and 64, you have to have a fishing license to participate in Crank for Bank because of the Alabama state law. If you are younger than 16 or older than 64, you do not have to have a fishing license to participate. All right, let's keep going. So um, it's very easy, and the first thing that we are going to do is go to OutdoorAlabama.com. All right. And so when you get there, you are going to see this big landing page, and we are just going to go right here to the first option, Licenses, and you'll see this drop down. And you're going to go to your second option, which is Purchase a License. So let's click on that and then you will come to this main landing page and down here on the bottom since we're doing it online you'll be able to print your license after completion. So let's go ahead and start filling out our information, our country of res residency, United States of America, state is Alabama and then here you will just fill out your birth month, day and year. And after you fill that out, you just hit continue. And then this is the next page that you are going to see. And this is going to have all of your different package options um, for licenses that you can purchase. Um, but for our purpose today, just for me, the fishing for the tournament, I'm actually going to scroll down here and go down to the 2021 freshwater license and click on that and I am going to select this option right here the residential freshwater fishing for $14.05 so I'm going to click on that so I'm just going to click on that and then as you can see it was added to my cart and we will continue All right, and then you will see this, and it's a hunter educational requirements. However, if you see right here under fishing license, you'll see a hunter education certificate number is not required for persons who wish to purchase a fishing license who only intend to fish, which is me. So what you will want to do is click hunter education supervision. And continue. All right, and then you will come to this page. And if you would like to have a collectible hard card license option, it is an additional five dollars each. Um, I believe this is completely optional for you, and you can either select a design that you would like, or you can say, I do not wish to purchase a hard card. Me, personally, I kind of want to get a hard card, so I'm going to select this one. This one looks nice. And then select Continue. All right. And now here you will see your final shopping cart. So I have my freshwater fishing license, which is 1405 
And then I also have my durable card, which is completely optional. I personally wanted a hard card for $5. Here is my total. And then down here you have the option to donate and round up um, for any one of these. And I will say yes for freshwater fishery research since that is what we are buying our license for today. And then we can continue. All right, and then at this point, you are going to put in your information, such as your driver's license for Alabama, and as well as your first and last name to continue. All right, here we are getting close to the end. Here you are going to put in your personal information. This is your mailing address, and I'm assuming this is so I can get my hardcover fishing license. So I'm going to go ahead and put that info in now. All right, and then after you put that information in, you are now here at your demographic info. We'll select no for bird hunt since we are only purchasing a fishing license. I'm going to go ahead and select no on this page. Continue. All right. And then right now you are going to want to read through all of your residency requirements and the terms. After you have read through all of this, you will select that you agree and submit. And it will bring you to your final summary information page. Hit continue one last time. And this is where you will put in your credit card payment information. Here is your summary right here of what you are purchasing. All right, so I have my freshwater fishing license. I have my hard card design. I have my roundup for research. My subtotal with the total fees and everything doing it online and this is our final step so we'll go ahead and put our information in once that's all put in and you double check your information you're gonna hit submit payment and the transaction is complete there we go we now have our fishing license and since we did it online you do have the option to print a copy of your license or if you download the Outdoor Alabama app on your iPhone or Android your license will be displayed on there as well um, and it does say here a digital copy of your license displayed on your phone or tablet is considered valid so you have both of those options if you did not purchase a hard copy um as well so there we go that's our fishing license super easy i've never even actually done this before so i'm glad that we were able to make it through that together and now let's move on to signing up for crank for bank Okay, so now that we have our fishing license, the next thing to do is to actually register for Crank for Bank. And this is very, very important. You can't just go out and catch a fish and then sign up. You have to be registered for at least two full hours for Crank for Bank in order to win one of these prize fish. I would hate for you to go out there, catch one of these tagged fish, and then have to let it go and not actually win any money because you skipped this step. This is so important important. So what we are going to do is we are going to go to crankforbank.com and that's C-R-A-N-K, the number four, bank.com. Crank, the number four, bank.com. Dot com. And we'll bring you to this awesome homepage for Crank for Bank. And what you are going to do is you are going to scroll all the way down, take a look at all of the sponsors, and then right there, boom, get registered. And so what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to click here where it says register here. Click on that. And it's going to take you, it looks like, to Fishing Chaos. All right. 
And then down here you have all of your information about when the tournament starts, when the tournament ends, July 4th, 2021. Um, and then you're gonna wanna take a second to read through all of this different information. Um, it's gonna tell you the difference between you know, purchasing a $75 ticket and purchasing a $100 ticket. Um, but as you can see, over 200 tagged bass have been released into Lake Martin Waters. Um, and so you'll just want to read through all of this information so you can get a better idea about that. Click on the rules so you know what to do um, when you actually catch one of these tagged fish and um, what you have to do, how you can catch them, um, rules and regulations, you know, things of that sort. But today, for this purpose, we want to go ahead and register. That's the whole point. You have to be signed up to get out there and catch one of these fish. So we are going to click right here to register. And we are going to click on create a new account because, like I said before, I've never done this. This is my first year, so we are going to create a new account. And we'll just put our first name. Select an angler to buy online tickets or to claim a paper ticket. This is me. And it is missing some information that I'm going to go ahead and put in now. Continue. Okay. So after you fill out all of your personal information, you are going to come up to this form. Your angler registration. There's my name. And then are you all in? Are you going to get your $100 ticket and be a part of the virtual tournament and the $1,500 tagged fish and all these other prizes? Yes, I am. That one works for me. That's uh, what I'm interested in. But you do also have this other option to get the signature ticket, which is $75, which does also come with big money fish and lots of really cool prizes too. So if that's more your route, you can go for that. Me, I'm all in. So then you're going to click continue. Subscriptions. Um, since I am not a particularly big time fisherman, no thanks, I don't fish often, um, but you can select one of these other subscriptions if you would like. Um, that might be really interesting for you. Um, and then we're going to hit checkout. And we are going to add a payment method. Okay, and then after you have entered in all your payment information, you can just double check it um, in your cart. There's my name, there's my ticket of what my grand total is. This tournament covers fees for you. That's awesome. And everything looks good, so we're going to click pay now. All right, and that's it. There it is. We got it. I'm all in. Now what I will do is download the Crank for Bank app or the Fishing Chaos app and check that out, and then all my information should be there. Okay, that's it. We are now all signed up for Crank for Bank. It was literally that easy, and we can all go out there now and catch that million-dollar fish. Make sure you stay tuned for an upcoming episode where we go behind the scenes and interview OGS tournaments and the people who are putting on this awesome tournament for all of us. And don't forget to follow Pelican Point Expeditions on Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, and Lake Martin TV, any one of those channels, so that way you never miss an adventure with us. Never miss an adventure. Like and follow Pelican Point Expeditions on YouTube, Facebook, and Instagram. And stay tuned for the next episode on Lake Martin TV.